so hello dear students welcome to the new lecture of the course and in this particular lecture we are going to see the another question okay so let me write that particular question over here so let's suppose again we will take the same question but now here we are changing the conditions okay so that you will um, be able to see the concept in much more broader way okay so let's suppose i'm considering the same uh, question which we consider in the previous video if you want to form a three digit number three digit number from from the numbers from the numbers 1 2 3 and 4 okay such that such that repetition repetition of any number of any number is not allowed is not allowed okay so how many how many three digit number can be formed or basically this particular sentence is asking you how much cases are possible of three digit numbers right so basically this particular sentence is asking you how much cases can be formed of three digit number so this is what the question is right so again to understand this particular thing we have to understand this particular part i hope now you are familiar with this form a three digit number out of uh, this particular set of numbers 1 2 3 4 right such that repetition of any number is not allowed what does this particular line mean sir now you explain me this particular line this is pretty difficult to understand my dear student it is not at all difficult to understand what this particular line tries to tell you is this again i am considering same, same example 1 2 3 this is a three digit number just a second i will take i will just reduce the thickness of the pen mm, let me just uh, erase this particular thing yeah so 1 2 and 3 all right so this is a three digit number and as you can see none of the number is repeated so again so this is a valid case but if i'm considering this particular case that means this one 1 2 and 2 as you can see this 2 is repeating itself two times right it is a three digit number but in the question it is what it is given that any of the number uh, sorry repetition of any number is not allowed and here two is repeating itself two times right so this particular case is invalid so in this particular scenario we are not considering this particular case similarly if i am considering this case 4 4 4 so as you can see uh, this 4 is repeating itself three times this 4 is repeating itself three time although it is a three digit number but now it is going to be invalid case why because in the question it has been mentioned that repetition of any number is not allowed so now it's my request to you all guys please pause the video and try to solve this particular numerical or this particular question on your own because this will give you a clear cut idea of how the things are going to work in the further right so it's my request please pause the video and try your best to solve so now i hope that you and uh, tried your best to solve this particular numerical now it's my turn so that won't be any doubt in your mind i will try my best to solve this particular numerical right so again what i will do i will make three dashes indicating that you have to fill hundreds place tens place and units place so this is hundreds place this is tens place and this is units place correct so now what we have to do we have to how we have to proceed further first of all we have to see the units place remember one thing whenever you are dealing with such kind of numerical you have it's my request to you all guys first try to fill units place okay first try to fill units place provided first see the condition because you know the in like in the further videos or in the fur further lectures there are going to be certain condition where we have to start uh filling the places from the hundreds place okay okay so at that time i will tell you what kind of logic we have to apply at that particular time but as of now for this uh, particular numerical it's, it's my request to you all guys try to fill the place or try to fill this particular conditions from the units place right so what the question is telling form a three digit number from 1 2 3 4 such that repetition is repetition of any number is not allowed okay so at units place we can either put 
or we can either put two or we can put three or we can also put four so that means what from one to four we can put four numbers right either we can one uh, sorry either we can put one two three four so that means in all we have four such cases possible or four such cases available right so we can write over here four such cases can be possible and at the units sorry and at the tens place what we can fill so what we can fill at the tens place right to form a three digit number we require units place and tens place and hundreds place so i'll straight away write over here uh, i will straight away indicate the multiplication sign over here indicating that it is getting multiplied right so my dear students what you will do over here see first of all give importance to each and every conditions the condition is that first of all as you can see there are four numbers available so basically it can be filled in four different uh, ways that means either one can come here two can come here three can come here or four can come here that means one to four numbers can accommodate for, uh, in the uh, tens place right but now you will ask me sir but now only you told me that this particular condition is not valid that means repetition is not allowed and how come you write this particular thing absolutely it is wrong but one thing i just i had not uh, written one thing intentionally and that is whatever number that has came in units place that won't come so that the number which came in units place that won't come so this is the important case as uh, just a second i'll write it a uh, little below yeah so whatever the number that has been present in the units place that won't come here okay what does that mean sir that means let's suppose again i will uh, i'll take this a uh, little downwards i will draw this particular thing little uh, downwards and i will multiply this particular thing indicating that it is um, getting multiplied so let's suppose if let's suppose if two came over here so obviously apart from two the other three numbers that means either one can come either three can come either four can come right but two cannot come or two cannot ac accommodate this particular place that means this particular uh, tens place right so this is what it means so that's why i told you now the first condition was first see the devil is in the details right so first fill the conditions and then move uh, first fill the first condition okay the uh, very beginning condition and then proceed to the next condition so the very first condition was as you can see we we have been we had been given four such numbers so that's why i had written over here we can fill this place into uh, four such cases provided the number which came in the units place that won't repeat in the tens place okay i hope now you are getting my point and thus as you can see over here only three three cases are possible right only three cases are possible so that's why here i can write only three cases are possible right only three cases are possible similarly as you can see over here if i'm moving towards hundreds place uh, let me take certain different color yeah so we'll take this one so now as you can see again i'm taking the very first condition hundreds place can be filled in four different condition maybe one or two or three or four right that means i can fill hundreds place into one to four different ways provided the number which came in units place that won't come and the number which came in the uh, tens place that also won't come that means number which came in tens place that won't come right i hope you are getting my point what i meant to say is this see let's suppose uh, just a second let me uh, get one eraser yeah okay so what i meant to say is let's suppose uh, here I, I would have filled this particular number in one two three four different ways so let's suppose at the units place i have two at the tens place let's suppose out of one three four i have one over here okay so that means in the hundreds place i can only have three or four only two options right so that means only two such cases can be possible so over here you have to write only two such cases are possible i hope you are getting my point my dear students again i'm trying to explain you this particular thing what i'm what exactly i had done over here as you can see over here the for uh, the uh, in the question there was one condition that you have to form a three digit number from the uh, given set of number that means this are these are the set of numbers which are available right one two three four such that repetition of any number is not allowed that means this particular case cases are invalid one two two or maybe four 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 or maybe one 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 two one one uh maybe 
वन टू वन ओके इफ द नंबर आर रिपीटिंग इट सेल्फ मे बी मोर दैन मोर दैन इक्वल्स टू टू राइट सो यू हैव टू कंसिडर दिस पर्टिकुलर केस एज इन वैलिड ओके सो एज यू कैन सी ओवर हियर वॉट वी आर डन इन इन यूनिट्स प्लेस वी आर स्टार्टेड टू यू नो फील दिस पर्टिकुलर थिंग फ्रॉम द यूनिट्स प्लेस ओके एज यू कैन सी दिस आर द यूनिट्स प्लेसेस सो दिस इज अ यूनिट प्लेस सो इन हाउ मेनी वेज वी कैन फील यूनिट्स प्लेस एज यू कैन सी वी कैन आइदर फील यर वन और वी कैन फील यर टू और वी कैन फील यर थ्री और वी कैन फील यर फोर सो इन ऑल वी हैव फोर सच केसेस दैट मीन्स आउट ऑफ वन टू फोर एनी नंबर कैन बी एकोमोडेटेड ओवर यर फॉर टाइम बिंग विल कंसिडर दैट लेट सपोज इफ टू इज एकोमोडेटिंग और टू इज कमिंग इन दी मे बी हंड्रेड प्लेस सॉरी एक्सट्रीम सॉरी लेट सपोज इफ टू इज कमिंग इन दी यूनिट्स प्लेस राइट सो दैट मीन्स वॉट द नंबर विच कैम इन यूनिट्स प्लेस दैट कैनॉट कम इन दी टेंस प्लेस एज यू कैन सी ओवर यर here two came just a second yeah here in the units place two came in the tens place also two came and in the hundreds place one came so as you can see uh, the numbers cannot be same in tens and units place so that's why this condition got rejected similarly over here in the units place three came in the tens place two came and in the uh, hundreds place one came right so this particular condition has three distinct values and that's why this particular case got uh, valid right or this particular case got accepted for this particular question right similarly over here what we can see uh, is that uh, uh, right now two came in the un uh, units place so we have to deduce sorry we have to neglect it for uh, uh, when we are dealing with the tens place so we have to reject it sorry we have to reject it when we are dealing with the tens place right so this is the tens place okay and what we are what we are having right now is 1 3 4 right because two came in units place so right now we just have three numbers 1 3 and 4 let's suppose in the tens place one came right let's suppose in the tens place we are getting one right so that means one got rejected and thus in the hundreds place only two numbers can come that is 3 or 4 so that's why we have two such cases and that's why we have two over here so if you multiply all of them you end up getting the value as what Three fours are twelve. Twelve twos are twenty-four. So we end up getting the value as twenty-four. So that means twenty-four such cases can be possible if the repetition is not allowed. I hope you are getting my point, right? So this is the absolute correct value or the absolute uh, correct answer. That means twenty-four such cases can be formed for a three-digit number from the numbers one, two, three, four, such that repetition of any number is not allowed. Okay. So I hope you understood this particular concept very well. So thank you for listening to me patiently. I am ending this video over here. Thank you.